Well, everybody, you're not even safe on SoundCloud from censorship. Even in, I don't know if it's the lyrics or if it was just some triggered clown that kept like spam reporting shit, but he got shit taken down off my SoundCloud and it was not against the rules. I'm about to go over examples. I'm about to talk about all kinds of stuff in this wonderful event that happened today. So we all know that censorship is getting crazy. It's getting to the point of just, there is no freedom of speech. There is not freedom of speech. No, there isn't. But right here, a song, a song. Now you'll see anorexic bitch cock in her tummy freestyle. Now, yeah, the name of that's explicit, but guess what? Music is explicit. Music is explicit. And this, this song was doing really well. It was over 4K, and for me, those numbers are pretty good. And it just kept going and going and going. People liked the song. It was a good song. And the album cover, I'm about to show you the other album covers that are on SoundCloud that get away perfectly fine here. Let's pull this up. I mean, it's it's not fully pornographic, but it's, let's let's see. It's nothing worse than what you would see on Instagram. It was similar to, to one of those album covers. It wasn't that album cover exactly. I don't have the album cover anymore because it was a song that was released a couple months ago. But this is bullshit. People like this get to skate away and they get to make freaking 60K on their frick. They get 60K plays on their and their shit doesn't get taken down. My shit would have just kept going and going and going. They don't want people like me to grow. It's like... This could have been someone on Reddit that seems some of the stuff that I share on Reddit in terms of like the, they'll see a YouTube video and then they'll go on my Reddit and then they'll see that I shared music too. And maybe they got offended by something I said in a video. So they went and spam recorded my SoundCloud. You know, I'm not trying to be some ultra famous artist. I'm just, I'm just trying to reach a community of people like many artists do. You don't even have to be a number one, the weekend level star to, to, be appreciated by other people in making music but this is just ridiculous you know songs getting removed and that also those songs getting removed made it to where i can't monetize my soundcloud even though i pay for the monetization on soundcloud so i was making a couple hundred here and there from soundcloud and now i can't do that because because of censorship this is bullshit and you might say, oh, was it the lyrics of the song? I'm actually going to tone these lights down. I don't know if that kind of just like blurbing out my face with the red lights. But this right here, this better be recording audio or I'm going to be pissed. It was this song right here. This was the song. It might not play in its uh, full quality. This might be a different mix of it. But it's a darker vibe song. And it has darker lyrics. But lyrics, are lyrics what we're getting censored, censored over now? We got to censor that too? This is fucking stupid. I don't think it's recording the audio from it. I don't, I don't think it is. No, it's not. Okay, well, it's not recording the audio of the song. I'm glad I looked at OBS, but... Irregardless, maybe I'll put up the song on the YouTube. I didn't really want this channel to be just for that, but this is this is pissing me off. I'm I'm getting really close to just being done with this shit. This is not the first time my music has been taken down. My music, I grew a Spotify back in the day to about 40k monthly listeners. Now, that was a nice paycheck. That was a nice paycheck. But people got the shit taken down. People got the music taken down. And yeah, I could get another disco kid. I can put it back up. But building it up, especially in today's climate for all that stuff, it's not gonna you're not gonna grow as fast, number one. And you have to have playlisting by major labels and different labels nowadays to even get plays on Spotify and shit. So this censorship is getting ridiculous. And I just wanted to put that out there that I mean, as an artist nowadays, you can just you can get stuff removed just from people triggered 
just triggered people on the internet with no lives, no lives, mind you, to report this stuff. It's not even necessarily an easy thing to do. They have to go through and jump a bunch of hoops. It's so stupid. I'm. This is fucking. You know what? I don't know. If you're an artist out there and you're watching this, hopefully this actually gets pushed in the algorithm on YouTube and doesn't get like half a view because no one, not even my subscribers are notified when I upload. But this is, this is stupid. And I, I'm not a big enough artist to reverse this. this is a, there was another artist that this happened to a few years ago. And I think he was around 9K or 8K followers at the time. And he was able to somehow reverse it. But I'm not... I'm not big enough to reverse it. Like, I'll, I'll respond to this email or find the actual email to respond to. But I was not, I wasn't, like, warned, like, hey, change something about this. It was just taken down as the song was doing good. <sighs> and now I also, the bigger point of this is that I, I lost the monetization due, due to this. Even though I pay the hundred and, like, twenty-something dollars that it is to fucking be monetized on SoundCloud. For the pro or whatever. So you know what? Fuck you, SoundCloud. I'm done with your fucking shit, SoundCloud. I'm done with all this shit. I don't know if I'm fully going to be done with music. I still write a lot of music and do that stuff for other people. But in terms of putting out my own stuff, this is really pissing me off. And censorship is getting out of control. Have a great one. If you're new, watch other videos to decide if you want to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, thank you. Please be sure to drop a like and drop comments below if this has happened to you or you're an artist yourself. Peace.